Right, let's uh, show you this thing. We've got a um, little NRF 24LO1 Plus module, Arduino Uno LCD display. I'll see if I can get this uh, focused up on the display so you can see the rest of it. Uh, yeah, that'll probably do. So, this is scanning the uh, 2.4 gigahertz band. Um, each block on the LCD represents about uh, 4 megahertz uh, of the band. So starting on the top row, it's 2.4 gigahertz exactly. And then the next block uh, is uh, 2.404 gigahertz and so on. And then by the time we get down to the uh, last block before the bit that's labelled not used, we're up to 2.480, I think. The legal band goes from... 2.4 gigahertz to 2.4835 so basically covering the whole band here um, and the activity you can see at the moment is the uh, is my Wi-Fi uh, router so I'll switch that off and I uh, shouldn't see very much now bits of noise from neighbours Wi-Fi routers maybe but as you can see the band's pretty quiet now I want to fire up a Tyrannis uh, and at the moment Manual. it's transmitting or it will be now this is uh, you transmitting using an orange module so say on the spectrum mode and this is DSM2 and you can see it's locked on to two frequencies and staying on them. Um, this is the way DSM2 works. The, the transmitter scans the band when it powers up, looks for two quiet spots and locks onto those. If I, if I switch off and back on again, it, it, it should pick another, well, it'll pick two slots and they'll probably Welcome be... To probably be in different positions this time. Manual. There you go, you can see it's different. A um, little bit different. And if, well, I'll just try once more. Welcome to Toronto's. Um, No, oh, there you are. It's right down at the bottom there for one of its picks this time. Now, in contrast, if we swap to um, one of the frequency hopping or spread spectrum modes, what have we got here? Let's try that one. So, this is using um, FreeSky uh, D8 protocol. And as you can see, it's uh, it's spread right across the band. The uh, the little carrots, are they call the little hat symbols. Um, they're showing a signal strength bigger than the eight bars, uh, but it's a bit misleading because. All of these protocols are switching on and off rapidly and the little uh, NRF module can only see a signal or not. So th there's a lot of averaging there and you get a sort of, uh, you get some strobing effects as well. So we'll switch the Tyrannis off now. Uh, you can see it's decaying away to nothing. And I'll put my Wi-Fi router back on takes a little while to power up uh, and then we should see that uh, starting to occupy part of the band again and that's about it 
Um, there we go. I'll post this sketch uh, on the on the forum. Uh, well, as soon as I've uploaded this. Cheers. Thanks for watching.